this character's crazy. Like he's he's okay. I think he's mid tier or a little a little bit higher. But like the way King plays him, he just plays. I don't know. He's a low two hero, man. I like I like that. I like hearing players that. Uh, uh, it seems like he makes a lot of his money off being a cre being a, just a creative yeah, player. Yeah, yeah, he makes he makes it work. You know, like okay. nothing is given. It doesn't look, like nothing is given to him as a character as DDD. Like nothing. <laughs> so he just works with these guys, man. They, they, man, those characters, those players are actually really scary. Because if, what if they went to like a good character like Sheik or something like that? <laughs> then they have all the tools to work with. Like this guy is like building stone henges with like just his hands. There's like well, that's <laughs> the thing is like probably the reason why they don't play. Outside of like, if Didi's like his favorite character, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Outside of that, it's probably they feel probably more restricted with the better characters oh, like true, Sheik yeah. and stuff. So that's probably why they're there. So uh, KTB, of course, is Warrior. I'll swap the names there. We're getting right into it. No hand warmers needed. Yeah, Smash War. We don't. We don't play that <laughs> unless we have to buy the DLC. Unless we have to buy the DLC <laughs> and the buttons are wrong. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's all. It's all there. Oh, well, but yeah, yeah. See, the Gordo's not safe at close up, but like, it's surprisingly that it's not safe at most ranges. But the way he like he can angle the Gordo to go like farther out or like it bounces high. Like he's got two angle like. Two kind of uh, mix-ups with that and so like it's not safe but it'll keep bouncing on your shield so you have to know what to do like you have to know to get out of the situation so Ooh. if you so if you can call hold and block too long you're looking at a break yeah yeah oh yeah that or he also has a scary like you can see he's going for the inhales he's got a command grab but so does okay. Wario see not very many characters have command grabs but like these are the few characters like I, I, this one and I think Diddy Kong I, I can't think of anything else off the top of my head but like there's only like a handful of characters okay. that have command grabs and we, and we managed to get both of them in the same match which is interesting because like a dominant strategy for punishing landings in uh, Smash Wars run up shield their aerial and then punish whatever they're doing but like now because like no, most people can't do anything that beats shield in the rock scissor game you know right 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 and so the most they can do is probably fast fall like and go for a grab but uh mm. they, they can actually go for it, which is really scary because you have to start you have to play with more movement because you get to sit outside the range and wait for them to do it and the, the thing that i like most about watching kcb's play so far is his ability to really treat you with kid gloves in the first round mm -hmm. maybe the first set yeah yeah and then just they're off download your ass yeah. right and go to it and you mentioned you mentioned these guys play all the time, so if you're watching at home and you're like, why isn't Wario punishing with this, or why isn't DD doing X? Well, when you play, when you have a training partner and it comes down to tournament, you're going to see a lot of unorthodox stuff. Yeah, yeah. So a lot of, uh, Not that you know, here for it, it, might, it, might, it might seem random, but it's all part of their level of Yomi, yeah, right? right there. They know that you know that I know that he knows. <laughs> yeah. Those, oh man, the weird projectiles. Wow, the clash was weird. Uh, we're like a pseudo projectile with like the the bike, but it's it's kind of a weird hitbox. Oh yo, that almost killed. Now Wario just got waft online. Yeah yeah yeah. The waft timer is a minute forty eight. Oh he tried. Wow. Oh. <laughs> that was like the most unfortunate thing that could have happened there. Not only did he miss his wasp, but he got killed. Like he got killed for like most time. Like you see how far high it went. Yeah. Most time you can't even punish that because like I don't know. But that was crazy. Yeah, that was good. Oh. Good match awareness by by King's part. Just. Yeah, like I said, it's almost like they play each other quite a bit. <laughs> and now this is gonna be hard for Wario. Wario's just come back. Uh, DDD's a really good character to stay alive. Like he's a, he's a big dude. He, he he's really heavy, and plus his, his recovery is really good. He's got multiple jumps. That also adds to the mix-up of the inhale. Oh, he held down that. He could have he could have lived that. Like there's no red flash. I don't know if you know, but if you see like you'll see like a red spark happen, like okay. a knockback, and that means they're going to die unless they di correctly. Oh, and, okay. And if they don't, if that doesn't happen, it means they di'd wrong. And like that one, they probably oh, I, think, right. I, think, I think he held down is what happened. Because the game has like a, 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 a like an in, internal way to know, I guess like sure, a, sure. Yeah, yeah, just, it just knows like you'll see it'll happen. Oh, the nair. Oh, okay, okay, that was a good idea. Crazy. That was a crazy. That's pretty creative. It's one of those things where Smash Four is full of things that, that are not guaranteed, but they put them in, they put the opponent in a situation. Wow, what? I guess can he shield through that? Is that not a? Uh, well, it doesn't suck you in if you're shielding. Like, okay. uh, but if you're point blank, it'll still suck you in. It'll still grab you. But the hitbox, the the, 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 sh the wind thing is like a hitbox. It's a wind hitbox, so he can oh, get blocked okay, by okay, shielding. Okay. That was a little bit of the oh yo that foot wow. yo that was a clever combo using DDD to <laughs> go back in there and combo himself. Yeah, I mean, and that was very good defense too, just on the corner. I mean, that was a pretty tricky setup. Had to deal with the projectile and DDD's incoming. Yeah. Nice neutral right there in the middle. I like seeing that. You can't hit it. if you in the game of Smash. If you hit it, uh, it'll go back in. Like it's like yours now. It'll, right. Yeah. Oh, he's, he knows. He KCB. Uh, uh, so this inhale looks like it's easy to work around, but man, let me tell you, it's playing. A, it's a match trying to like. You always want to run up and hit somebody when they're landing because you know landings when they're really vulnerable. But right. uh, DDD has multiple jumps and he's really heavy and he has uh, the inhale, which is just like, oh, you run around a shield, like. Yeah, like, it's always scarier, scary when a quote unquote grappler is yeah. very fast. Oh yes. Like it's, if their movement's really good, you've just pretty much you as a player you've overcome. This is my favorite setup. I've seen Beast do this a couple times. Oh, the, oh, the, yeah, yeah, it's either it's either uh, eat the motorcycle. 
or block the motorcycle and then get scooped. Yeah, like that's that's so smart. It's yeah, it's, he makes like, it's crazy. It's like kind of an unorthodox. Like you wouldn't think like the the bike setup, you know, to be crazy. Cause yeah, that's some street that's some street fighter stuff though, right there. You throw the the the, the, the meaty projectile and they're like, well, uh, if I get hit. Uh, I don't get thrown, but if I have to block this, that puts them close enough range and then scoop me up. Like that's it's like yeah, it's like the birdie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, exactly. He's and he started walking down. Yeah. Like, the can's rolling. He's like, yep, you either gotta walking. block this can or you gotta take this command grab. Yeah, like good luck. Yeah. All right, so Beast really thinking about it right now. Taking his time like he should. It was a very close match. He just seems like there's a few, like those wasps really were his downfall. He just seems to be, he seems to hit him, man. <laughs> yeah, both these guys laughing. Like I said, it's good to see training partners go at it, but at the same time, man, nobody wants to get uh, sent home. And this is losers round seven, trying to get oh, that yeah. big money. A lot, of, a lot of people playing this tournament. Oh yeah, it's like a 50 something man tournament. Oh, yep. Ooh, the back here, the meaty back here. Ooh, you got oh, the grab. no, the momentum is just on King's yeah. side right now. It's hard to come back, I guess, against the DDD. First of all, it's hard to kill, but, like, he also just racks up damage ridiculously mm. fast. If, like, oh, that was a good nair. See, it, that man, KGB's on top of these, these uh, setups with uh, the Gordos, but, like, a lot of other players just, like, don't know how to handle it because they don't, like, you either have to, you have to hit it right, because if you try and hit the Gordo, you risk miss, like, misspacing it and taking the Gordo to the face, you know? Oh, okay. It has to be, like, spaced well. Yeah, and also, it just bounces weird, too. Yeah, yeah, and he can change the angle on it, and, like, you yeah. Wow. Oh, 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 it's a lot of air, man. Yeah, wow. scramble. Like, some, like, yeah. air footsies, like. Yeah, dude. That was kind of crazy. Well, uh, uh, aided by the fact that DDD has multiple jumps, but KTB's, man, managed to bring the percent back, just like, I think oh, it's, it's, it's his convincing, like, ledge game. I feel like it's just so solid, like. Oh, look at this. this all the patience is so good. All yeah, right, all like, right, all right. Finds one in. <laughs> oh, I love yeah. that. Those, dude, those motorcycles that I gotta play. Boss. Oh, cool. I gotta go play Street Fighter, man. I'll be back soon. All right, good luck, man. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Yeah. All right, shout outs to uh, Fragger. Yo. Uh, hanging out. And good yo. luck to him in a Street Fighter Thank 5 you. match. Thank you. I played Witch Dog between Street Fighter 5 and Smash 4 like the entire game. The entire yeah. Game. Uh, looks like Grunion's gonna assist assist me on commentary. Praise B. Yep, like I said, I, I, the, the levels the levels of Yomi here are, are pretty good. Like, they, one guy knows, he knows, and I know that you know. It's all there. What's up, Grunion? Oh, uh, hey, how you doing, man? Welcome back. Thank you, it's good to be back. I love commentating. <laughs> yeah, great, because I, I was trying to flounder by myself there. <laughs> uh, all right, so it looks like King took the first game here. Yes, and, uh, it, you know, these guys, I guess, are training partners. They play a lot, yeah. so you're seeing a lot of, I guess, unorthodox stuff. Um, you know, pretty common what you see when you play uh, somebody you play all the time, you know? Wow. Yeah, this was actually the uh, grand finals of a tournament I went to yesterday at mm. uh, Johnson County Community College. Oh, nice. Yeah, KT Beast actually, uh, he won. He won a winner's finals and grand finals set one, so... Uh, okay. But I think King has a positive record against KT Beast, but KT Beast is like... He's a real up-and-comer. I remember a couple months ago, I bodied him in pools, and now he beats me when we play. Like, he is improving at a rapid rate. That's and awesome. he's showing it right here against one of uh, one of Missouri's finest players, King. Yeah, Fragger mentioned that you know Didi not being a uh, necessarily good character in a lot of the eyes of the, of the Smash community, but King very good at being creative with how he gets in. Oh yeah, no, he's a very creative player. He's very smart. Wow, man, so many command grabs. Every time I see a command grab, I'm just like, man, I bet, the, I bet the other guys just like, I knew that was gonna happen. I uh -huh. knew that. I've seen that a hundred million times, and I still fell for it. No, that's how I feel every time I get wafted by Wario. <laughs> or, sorry, not wafted, uh, the, the chomp. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and that. You just feel silly when you get swallowed by DDD or Kirby. It is not sure. a good feeling. This is a really close game, though, but I've definitely got to give the advantage to KD Beast right now because he's got that waft online. He's just one solid read away from winning the game and tying up the set count. Oh, gets a little greedy there, trying to find some food after it. And the projectile spacing by King has just been on point. Oh no! He's got his bike. He's gonna make it out. All right, and he's back on stage. Nice power shield on the Gordo. That would have put him in a very disadvantageous position. Good back throw isn't gonna do it. Here's the setup, though. Oh man. Nope. We've been seeing. We've been throwing. He's been throwing the motorcycle straight up on people's recovery on the way in. So it's been a pretty good media setup. Oh, Another yeah. throw. Nah, that's stale. And King DDD is heavy, anyways. So. Oh wow. wow! What an answer. Here's the setup. Nice patience by King. See, I, I feel like any other DD player right in the country is gonna like you know get up off that ledge and just eat that motorcycle. Oh yeah, but no, very smart, very patient. Oh my goodness, that's the matchup knowledge. 
Look, what can, like, what can you do about that, man? Bounce. It's uh, it's rough. I don't know. This is so tense right now. KTB's hanging on to his tournament life. I thought that was going to be a waft, honestly. He just whiffed a grab instead. Oh, the neutral's very good right here. Oh, wow. Yeah, you see the it. whiff throw? That whiff was... throw into the butt? <laughs> oh, that was crazy. And KTB won that without using the waft. He just solidly outplayed him the whole game. And you know what that means, right? That means that he's got that in his back pocket for this game. So there's been tendencies that have been laid out. What do I do in X situation here? What is he doing in situation Y? And the waft never came out. So I assume King being uh, as proficient player as is, and of course being training partner is gonna gonna keep that in mind. But I expect that to come out and be a major factor here in this game, in this uh, final game. Again, this is losers round seven. Okay. Cool. All right. So right back into a one-one King and KT Beast. I like this counter pick. Uh, it makes the bike less effective if you can't just go through the middle of the stage with it. Mm -hmm. There's definitely platforms to hide out on. Also, it gives the Gordos a lot of room to bounce around. Mm -hmm. But that might actually be an advantage for KDP. He might be able to hide under platforms to uh, alleviate some of the pressure those put on. But I guess if they're bouncing like that, they're going to be coming right at you. And they'll hit whether you're on the ground or on one of the mm -hmm. lower platforms. That's really smart, actually. This is All a good right counter pick. On. I like it. But KT Beast has a slight lead to uh, start the game here. It's very, you know, it's very tit for tat, man. Who has, who has the read is what it comes down to. Oh yeah, no, I mean, these two, they they very clearly play each other a lot. You can see how up close and personal they're fighting. Like yeah. they they know what each other want to do. Yes. They're both very familiar, very comfortable here. It's really fun to watch players when you. Uh, when they're that comfortable. Yeah, and, and on top of that, just being per very proficient with the characters that they're playing, right? It's not its not just a bunch of uh, floundering around and flopping around. Oh yeah, no, both both very strong down. with their characters. I know KT Beast used to uh, main Charizard and Pit, but uh, he's had a lot more success in switching to Wario. I think Wario is a much better character than either of those, but... Okay. It also, re it really suits his patient play style. Stoff. Wow, motorcycle just sending the bomb back. Oh wow, rare bit of aggression. KT Beast diving off stage with the down air, but nothing, uh, nothing coming of it. Man, these every stock exchange has been pretty high percent. Uh -huh. I don't think there's been any other match this tournament that's that Walk. every stock no. goes this long. Got to get some more pummels in there. You can get two or three at that percent even if he's mashing super hard. That might have been the difference between forward throw killing and not. He's, he's got to go for these pummels. It's stale now, it's not going to kill otherwise, but back throw should do it. No, man. Wow, D D is super heavy. Ooh, super oh heavy my right goodness. Oh, it's not quite going to kill. Good DI by KT Beast. Wow, dude, that was so sick. Bounce off the shield and catch the spike ball. Mm -hmm. yeah, that was... <laughs> oh, man. It basically just makes DD like that much taller when you've got an active oh, hitbox wow. bouncing around. That killed of all the things, of it all the work that KTB had to put in, that's what killed. I didn't see I didn't see Sparks and I didn't see him die right away. So I think what must have happened there was he jumped right while he was at the edge of the blast zone and it mm. pushed him in because of the knockback penalty. When you jump, he's a special move. It pushes you back slightly. Oh, okay. So I think if he just waited another half second, and not done anything, he would have lived there. But as it is, this has put KD Beast in a very advantageous position. So I imagine even with DDD's massive weight, with 150% worth of rage, you know, max rage, an up air and a waft confirm is going to end the game and the set. Oh. And and he just... Oh, no. He blows it early. That's unfortunate. Oh, yeah. The, the very animated reaction there from KTB. He's yeah. not happy about that. That's the tournament nerves, man. That's the... Uh, yeah, that that's had... That tournament stamina you got to work on. Oh, yeah. That had to be a tech error because uh, he looked very confused as to why, yeah. why that happened. That being said, he still has a, a lead, a bit very, very marginal. Oh, yeah. I'll hit the patience right here. Go to neutral, reset the entire game in the situation. Both players, giving both players time to think about what's going on. Uh-huh. Wow, I like Deity just keeping those bombs very close, able that to really cover pressure. his approach. 
But yeah, you're not going to see KT Beast approach very often because the longer the timer runs, the stronger his waft grows, and it only benefits him to play a slower, campier game. So mm. as long as he has that percent lead, you're not going to see him go in. But King is doing everything in his power to bring this back. He's got it within 6%. Well, had. Yep, yep, yep. This is a very close game considering the weight differential. There's, it's very even right now. Wow, just Ooh. on the very edge of that uh, inhale box. Yeah, Finds right, one with the Gordo. Right as he rolled out, you could see him getting sucked in, but he was safe. Good Wow, roll. that mind game's right there. Yeah, with that roll, man, they've been going in all, oh, all set towards the middle. Oh, uh, yeah. Rarely would I say good roll, but that was definitely an instance of uh, smart usage. Never seen, I have not seen the Smash 4 timer be down this low, almost the one minute mark. Wow, 104 to 105. Who wants it more? Who wants it more? Uh, they're both they're both fighting so hard for this. They're both playing really smart, really patient. Yeah, the patience is like the biggest thing to take away from this game. Very great on both sides. Oh, the scrambles. Ooh. Looks like KT Beast is able to uh, get in just above King's moves. Mm -hmm. uh, he's sliding just over, and he has that waft online now. So he just needs one one solid read, and doesn't matter. <gasps> oh no, another self-destruct. Is this going to be enough? Oh wow, that's crazy. What an answer. Not quite. I'm running I away from that, the Gordo. I thought that waft was going to end it for sure. Wow, 30 seconds to play. Sorry, the timer is a little covered up there, stream, but yeah, you were down the last 20 seconds. Is that going to be enough? Oh. Wow. Wow. Congratulations, King. He clutches his app. Oh, that was. That was fantastic. That was a yeah, great man. display by both players. Yeah, you see the excitement on King's face right now? Yes, he jumped up in the air. Oh man, good stuff to KT Beast though. That could and that was just a just flip the coins, man. That oh, could have yeah. went either way. Oh, no, that was so close there. Excellent set from both players. Yes, absolutely. It's uh, it's funny though that you mentioned you'd never seen the Smash 4 timer get so low. Do you know uh, do you know about TTO? What uh, King had as his tag there? Uh huh. Well, uh, both King and KT Beast actually are members of TTO, which stands for Team Timeout. Team Timeout. See, which, I like that. Which is a crew of players that uh, that like to time people out. I like that. That's smart. Because I, when I was when I was uh, at Evo uh, 2015 this last summer, uh, I was signed up to judge Smash Pool. That's what I got uh, uh, assigned with, and uh, I ended up not judging Smash Pool. But I was watching that Pac-Man player. Oh, Abadongo. Yeah, just just. Laming people out, the crowd was getting so hyped. It was just like Pac-Man on one side of the screen. Now it's on the other side of the screen. It was, it was. So I was like, yes, this is awesome. Lame them out. Use the timer, of course. Smart fighting game players use everything at their uh, as a resource. Your life, your meter, if your game has it, and of course the clock is also a resource you want to use. So in, in addition to spacing, life, you know, all that stuff, uh, the clock is still a resource that you want to use to your advantage, so good stuff. Oh, definitely. All right, so, um, shh, that... I'm going to pass the mic off to uh, Mr. Fragger. So thank you guys again for watching Kansas City Onslaught, hosted by Eric Shrine here in Kansas City. Got more Smash 4 on the way. Uh, we should. There's someone coming up soon, man. Hey, Fragger, how you doing? I'm good, man. Thank you. I just got back from Street Fighter 5. I won my first round successfully. It's good cool, stuff. though. Cool, though. Let us see who we got. Let me see the bracket actually. Yo, King just beat uh, KT Beast. That was, that was a close match. That was super close. Cause that was the grand finals of uh, Juco yesterday. Oh, was it really? Yeah. <laughs> nice. So they're gonna play the lose. Oh wow! I wonder how. MGG TT a freezer. Yeah. Try it. I saw freezer took the first game. Plus. But uh, then I then I was asked to come commentate. Do we have? Right? <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. I don't understand why why MJG Freezer wouldn't be played on stream. That's going to be one of the uh, the hypest matches. Well, we should go see. Excellent. Uh, sure. All right, cool. So we sh we should Freezer have King should be up here. We should get that. I'm going to go see if I can go. Yeah, so uh, just to, uh, if you guys are following along with the bracket at home, uh, MJG, the very freezer, he will play uh, Mr. Doom in the winner's finals. And it uh, looks like they're going to call it the drawing right now. Uh, if you guys are paying attention to the uh, little schedule we had going on here, I can 
to use my computer. Uh, I'm not uh, sure if this counts as a brief intermission word from our sponsor or not, because we are well past 5.30 at this point. <laughs> uh, so I think they're calling out the drawing again. Uh, so Pro Gaming uh, hosting a drawing by uh, giving away a PlayStation 4 well, I play, I in addition round. to other uh, gaming stuff. So shout out to you. I'm gonna go grab, get that. I'm gonna go that match. Make sure it's on stream. The TT or the freezer versus game. Yeah. All right, yeah. So we're uh, doing a drawing right now. See if uh, I don't know how much of the crowd count you guys are gonna get. Oh, right on the edge, you get to see Watson. Looks like MJG making it up yeah, to. Yeah, I forgot about winners finals. Okay. So MJG uh, come up next. Winners finals. This is gonna be a three out of five set. Yup. We got MJG versus Mr. Doom. Kansas is two finest. Yeah, two of Kansas really exemplary players. Like two players that have like really been known outside of Kansas. Kansas has slept on a lot, but not these two. Not these two at all. Not at all. MJG is a nationally ranked player. If there's like a MI, if there's a top 100 brawl, like MI, like MI, like Melee and Ami does the list. Oh, there was a there oh, was, was a top 100 brawl. There hasn't been a Smash 4 one because the game's so yeah, yeah. Good, but I think Avril was like 30 something on the uh, right. on the brawl list. Which yeah, that sounds about right. Hey, Robbie. Ready for your match? Very good. Very good. You're gonna be in my pool against Full Boy. Full Boy. Twenty-five dollars to our list one bar. You can use the new way you want. I can hold on the stream. Okay. Cool. I feel like very So I can run those if you need me to. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, the up. Oh, that one's so much easier. So, smash for me, and then you can change. Okay. Yeah, it's yeah. Alright, cool. Starting off on game one. Alright. We're gonna pocket a day to start out the game one. These players have played each other numerous times. Nothing, nothing new here. Ooh. All right. MJG oh. scoring the first few hits here, getting some nice combos in. Ooh. I think with these characters, like some of their moves could be so safe. Like both their nares are so safe. Oh yeah, no. They're... You have to punish what comes after it. You don't. You, you get to. You get to guess. Like what's. what's next? Oh, MJG is playing really safe here, just dancing around Mr. Doom. Oh, using that stall. Helping his landing. MJG uses all of his tools to help him get back to the ground. Ooh, see, ooh shields. Oh, he got the nair off it. Wow. Oh, Doom off stage. Oh, good nair. That was so crisp. He, waited, he, he had the timing to everything. Like he knew the. Ooh, oh, off air. Wow. That was well, that was big damage was for a Yoshi. Scary. Oh, good. See that nair covers so much. Like that was so safe. Like I cry. Dinosaur walks. Uh, gets on the floor. Everyone walks <laughs> the dinosaur under under the Lloyd. Okay. We got MJ just got stage. Oh, see the oh good set, good set. Oh well the foot's still off the ledge. Oh he pockets that egg. Oh he brings throws it back. Power shield though, no. Yo, I bought some scrambled eggs. MJG <laughs> likes them scrambled. Well here we go. We've got MJG with a full oh, tree here, but uh, Yoshi kills early. Oh yeah, at 30 percent Yeah. Another 10% up smash might kill. I guess Village. And Yoshi headed, and Yoshi needs more percent. Oh, that might. Oh man, that was scary. I, not that, quite, not quite. that might have actually got staled on the tree, I don't know. Oh yeah, I'm not sure how that works in this game. Uh, I, I assume it's just like as long as he hits first, it, like, it lags, and then yeah. it staled just like normal. Oh, he, oh, dang, what? Okay, that was weird, he ran back and forth, but I was expecting like, a mix-up off of Lloyd on, or she, she, on uh, Doom's shield, but Doom was just like, I'm just gonna get hit by it. Good nair to punish the whiff grab. They're dancing around there. Oh, he won. He was waiting for. He's trying to get catch MJG jumping out of shield, but MJG just. He knows. He's, he, see, they're there. You want to catch something like that? Oh. Oh. Wow, see, MJG knows it all. Oh, oh and Doom goes a little too deep. Too yolo. That's unfortunate. Uh, now and now MJG. Just gonna go ahead and go to the other side of the stage. Very smart. Okay. All right. Oh, so he's playing. MJG playing smart. Just sit on the ledge. No, he doesn't need to. You don't want to rush your way back onto the stage. That's how you, that's how you die. Especially against someone against Doom Caliber. Oh, just holding oh, the shield yeah. right there on the ledge. Maybe a little too long. Oh, good Nair. Oh, wait. Oh, that was a crisp weight. That was such a crisp weight. That was he smart. Knew. That was really smart. 
that was one of those timing things where as a player, you should have to like, I don't know, you get a feel for when people want to leave situations and you uh -huh. just like when people leave their shields and you shut them. That's exactly what it was. Cause like even though Mr. Doom wasn't doing anything right there, he was applying a lot of pressure just by sitting under MJG on the platform, waiting for it when MJG was in shields. It's also hard because like shield drops and stuff in this game, right? You know. Yeah. Oh, he gets a single turn up! Oh man, nothing. Okay, he stops like the, the, the Yoshi stops that with the grab. Ooh. MJG is playing really slippery, but Mr. Doom definitely had the read on the B reverse pocket there and got the punish on it, but mm -hmm. Ooh, okay. still see MJG Good falling follow ahead there. here. He got oh. two triple turn ups there. RNG. Oh, three! This game loves this game loves April. Does love MG, MGG foes. Do another tag. Oh man, that down air too. That down air breaks shields, so you can't get caught on it. You gotta, you gotta play slippery. Like just like, oh, like he just walks. <laughs> MGG just walks up to the ledge, jabs him, and runs away. Yeah. Like that's I can't like that right there. Epitomies MGG's like play style. So like, he walked up, he would go to the ledge, come up the ledge, get jabs, walks away. He wanted to see what would happen after the jab one too, because I know he likes to uh, follow that up with an up air. But he wanted to see what Mr. Doom would do there, because that isn't guaranteed. You could also do jab one, jab two into act, not like it's tree active. Oh, that's true, but it's gone. A lot of times MGG just will throw his tree down just just to get the the act portion out. And it's really scary, just like sitting sitting behind the tree, just like what's good, guys. Ooh, see, I mean, a villager is oh, so way. slippery off stage. But there's certain characters who can like uh, who can pop balloons before they get there. Yeah. Well, the tree's coming out. Here we go. See now, mg has got axe online. Oh, Ooh, good that. pocket on the egg, but uses it right away. Goes right over Mr. Doom. Now MGG playing real slow right here. Doesn't want to risk anything. Just takes his. Oh, oh! If he had seen like the balloon, that'd have been most godlike. If he like timed. Punish the forward air because he liked it on blue. Oh, okay, there we go. No tech, no tech. I was about to say, Mr. Doom's actually had a, had a lot of rage. Like, Villager, like, isn't that heavy? Like, Yoshi's jab and up smash is also pretty ridiculous. On our way home, can we get food? Or, like, before we go to Anna's party? Yeah. Alright, cool. Um, they have pretty good hot dogs here. Oh, okay. I, I, I had no idea they had food here. I mean, it's, a, it's like, it's a $4 hot dog. Uh, so, but yeah, we can stop. We're, we're gonna. So. Alright, we got game two going to this. Like, oh, can you switch it to the the things are still on? Just click the. Should click between. It should be like. I mean, it's fine. I already updated the score. Okay. I'm not gonna worry about switching this thing. I don't know which is which. Gotcha. Sorry, right. team. I'm, I'm trying to uh, manage the stream here. We've got. Uh, it's fine. We're going back into. But here comes here comes game two. See a battlefield counter pick coming from okay. Mr. Doom. I like it. So you actually like the platforms? Oh, definitely. It also messes up Villager. Villager does really well in flat stages because that means his projectiles just have all the room in the world. Oh, yeah, no, you can just camp by the legs forever. It's like, and also, like, trying to land, it's like, just, you eat so many four days. Yeah, it's brutal. It's pretty, oh, oh, wow, wow but good. Villager's got oh, like, wow. excellent MJG, tech. Just a series of events that, like, MJG was wow. kind of got, got railed and also got out of a situation that should have been much worse for him. Yeah. Oh, see, oh, that was good by Dome or Doom because he saw the he saw the Lloyd rocket, saw the pattern, and just like went up and charged it, and was like, "I'm gonna hit you!" Like, oh yeah, <laughs> stall in the end, what you get, dog. That moves that like, but Mr. Doom with a strong start, game one, 50 damage. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, no, he's playing very smart here, but Battlefield maybe was the answer. We'll see. We'll see as the game progresses. Oh, the air dodge. Oh wow, see the air dodge. He knew. MDG knew the air dodge was not was a was a bait. They do a lot of the air dodge into Nair because oh, Yoshi's yeah. Nair comes out frame three, so like try and do something about that. <laughs> nah, it's very safe. Though I seen MDG do it earlier, where he'll like do run up up smash and that'll catch because up smash has a bunch of a boxes on Hill Villager. It'll catch the air dodge because it just got like you know the fireworks. <laughs> yeah. All right, MJG is definitely bringing it back. He's he's putting it together. But Yoshi is it, the thing about Yoshi is he's hard. To, he's kind of one of the harder characters to kill in the game, considering oh, no. he's got really fast moves and he's really heavy. Oh, Yoshi also has command grab. That'd be like what, five, four, five, five, Oh, he takes the tree. Oh, let's see. That was actually really good. Cause you don't want MJG is really good at mashing, and he could have mashed out earlier, but he sat in the egg. Cause the egg, you don't take any knockbacks. Like you sit there, you take the damage. Yeah. But that was super smart. Yeah, you always want to mix up uh, breaking out of the egg when you're playing the Yoshi player, because otherwise you're just going to die early every time. Yeah. Also, you might just, like, if they're smart, they'll sit up and, like, wait for you to pop out of it and just up marry you or up smash you on Battlefield. That was a beautiful recovery Ooh. by MJG. But, Trade. Uh, 
MDG. Uh, we're setting to neutral here. Yeah, we're set back to neutral. We got the tree out for MDG, so we've definitely got the axe on line. He plus he can always run back to the tree to like safety kind of. He can't eggs can't be thrown at him there. Yeah. Not like he has really too much issue with it anyways. Ooh, that hair. Mr. Doom playing really, really after he missed that up here. Oh, I think it, I want to see those trade nairs or trade like Yoshi nair yeah. and like there's like the, the battle of dumb moves. <laughs> oh my! Wow, MJG's the iron boots. Yeah, spectacular. It's more like iron pellets or something. Oh yo, the nair's gonna do it. See, I, I feel like MJG was waiting, wanted to see, was waiting for the uh, the tech like the the, the, the stage spike. Yeah. Frame and changed, but he went for the nair, which was smart because he knew nair would kill there because it normally you know it doesn't. But nah, uh, MJG was at a very high percent. That was a very smart option by Mr. Doom. Ooh, but, but he's definitely at kill percentage from a villager. And villager is always also oh dangerous to be offstage. You gotta watch out for that because Yoshi's love to kill, like, command grab with that. Oh, not the quite strong. Hate does not Battlefield quite. is big. Yoshi Battlefield. is heavy. Ooh, he's see, gonna like, super armor right through the slingshot there with his up B. Oh, see right there, up smash. You That'll know, do it. So good. He also used it on the tree, which I think it slows it down because it's taking it's hitting it's lagging on the tree, right? Uh -huh. Or no, can he not hit the tree? He can shoot. No, he can hit the tree. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, some damage though, some good damage on MDG. Oh, he's trying, MDG's a little bit corner, but he just walks out as MDG does with these things. <laughs> just <laughs> very confident. Just puts Lloyd up. He's like, he doesn't roll, he doesn't jump. He just knows because you retain all your options walking, right? It's yep. the best option. People aren't patient enough. Because when you jump, you run out of jumps eventually. You got to come back down. Plus, you can't grab in the air unless you're a broken character. <laughs> Ooh, the forward air. And MDG mounting up the defense, like, just throwing it down. Like, come back to this, like, Yoshi's, like, requesting permission to land, and MTG just saying no. <laughs> and he's gone from struggling to kill to actually, we are at a complete tie. Ooh, good see. MDG is so good at waiting for people to, like, because people will run up to beat, the way to beat the forward air is, like, the short out for shooting forward air and run up shield and, like, run after him. But MDG can, like, get it, wait, can it waits, like, the very last second to do it, so he drops the forward air really low. And he doesn't get two, he only gets one. And it's just, oh man, it's it, the way he mixes up his, uh, his, like, I don't know, his keep away game, so strong. He's playing really smart here, but not to count Mr. Doom out, he has the percent lead right oh, now. Oh, he could he definitely, definitely kill, this game. yeah. He could definitely kill real soon, if not now. Oh, yes, I think a jab and up smash would, he's got some rage. Ooh! Has to be something big. Oh, see, it, MDG going for those, the jab, the safe options when you're high percent, so he doesn't want to commit to anything. Yeah. He just, like, sits sees that jab like, right there, see? He doesn't want to, if he, if he punish, tries to go for 2 head for a punish, that could be a stock. Oh, see, uh, Doom trying to bait something out. Oh, he's also trying to set up the jab into Axe, too, because he's got the Axe set up. Mm, I, I, I figure he thought the Lloyd was going to save him right there. Stage. Oh, he almost knew. He's going really low. If Yoshi he's could go deeper, if Yoshi could go deeper, that was so, like, so... Oh, uh, yeah, no. Very smart. <laughs> oh, that was an up smash, I guarantee you. That was an up smash. Just, been, yeah. And JG goes right to the. This level. is really, it's, yeah, that, that's a really sketchy situation because Yoshi's jab, real good. And did you see, recognize that jab that he's just gonna jab on the ledge and goes for the forward air? It's like, stop yourself. Okay, all right, five percent of each other. They both could definitely die from each other. It's real close. Ooh, that Lloyd. Ooh, this is such a close game. This is so close. Ooh, Narrow that was shield, weird. very smart. Okay, is that gonna go? No, 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 Yoshi, Yoshi, we in there? Battlefield, big stage. The tree turn up, but he got the weak hit, weak hit box. Oh, good tech. MVG was not in position. Oh, the triple turn up. Oh, the jumps. Oh, the oh, <laughs> The confidence. That was crazy. The confidence in that. Yeah, Doom knows the oh. villagers grab is slow, and he can't do anything about that jab pressure on the ship. Yo, Mr. Doom Beautiful is like air dodge is coming out. Mr. Here. Doom is coming with very creative ways to try and like punish villagers, like absolutely absurdity off stage. Like he's trying. Oh, oh, the, the timeout! I didn't even realize. Oh my! It's it, it's it, it's wow. it's it. MJG goes with the classic, the MJG classic timeout. I didn't even realize it was happening. It's so so much shorter in the last game. MJG's used to playing a game where you have to sit for eight minutes. He only has to sit for six here. Oh yeah. Uh, MJG won. It's a percent. A percent. Uh, they're going to game three. I didn't even realize. That was a really close match. I didn't feel like it was a timeout. I felt like they were just playing smart. Playing yeah, slow. no. I mean, it, it doesn't help that we can't see the timer. I realized about 15 seconds before, it's like, wait, is that... Are we at zero minutes? Is, is this about to be over? <laughs> I fun. thought we had a minute left, though. <laughs> So that's also one thing you need to keep up when you're playing uh, villager is you want to keep your you want to keep your eye on the clock because they will try and run that to the best of their ability. Let me tell you. Oh, I mean, yeah. Yoshi will also try to do that. Hey guys. <laughs> What's up, man? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Because I know. 
Okay, cool. Please. Oh, yeah, I'll scoot him. Mm, two, three. We have three. We have, we have three more to get to grands, right? Yeah, we have like three sets to go until we until grands. All right. So if you're Mr. Doom here, you just went. You've had two close games with MJG, but you're down 2-0. Oh, are we seeing the Diddy Kong coming out from MJG? He wants an sh uh, interesting shift. He goes for you, and they go to FD. Oh, I think it's for, uh, Why would he come? I'm so Diddy Kong is not good on FD in this game. I'm so befuddled, but he knew he knew that you know the counter pick before you pick your character in game. And so, and he had he had FD as village. I don't know. If, I don't know if he just doesn't know or what. Who knows? Or if he just he just wants to go. Maybe he just wants to. He's feeling the Kong. Maybe just. Oh, okay. The barrels. That was a. Janky option could have worked out better. It's kind of an RNG option. Oh man, this Diddy man, MDG is like just all over uh, Mr. Doom now. Not trying like every time he goes to land, he's there. Like MDG is just going in. I need to take some notes here. I uh, I really struggle against Mr. Doom as a Diddy Kong player myself. Two, step one, just be MDG. Step two, just go in. <laughs> step three, question mark, question mark, question mark. Step four, profit. That was a crazy oh. combo coming out from Mr. See, Doom. one thing I actually look forward to is when Diddy Kong gets off stage, Mr. Doom is uh, has some experience playing against his character, especially in Brawl 2. Like it should not, oh, it's not yeah. a, it's not a different thing to to. Oh, wow, that nice wall flip was so, well, so crisp. Is it? It's the same just recovery, and he and so I, I, I can see some people like him challenging him off stage, which you kind of need to do uh, uh, against Diddy because Diddy's like super strong on stage. Oh yeah, his neutral game top tier. The reason he's so good. There's a reason why he was number one for a while. Mm. Mm. No Misses the tech, but doesn't matter. Oh, wow. No, he takes it. That was fresh. That was a fresh up air. Really? That was stale, that wouldn't have killed, but he hadn't used that for a while. I guess so. He'd been using back airs. This is dangerous. Uh, he dropped on there. Oh, he tried. Wow, the ledge snap. What? Magna hands. MJ, yeah, MJG just knows, man. The monkey hands. Oh, the foot. <laughs> That was smart. <laughs> oh, why is he changing barrels? That's such a... Oh, I, oh he's, gonna be he's dead. dead, yeah. Rip. Like I said, offstage, Diddy Kong, not so great. It's not where you want to be. It's not the promised land. All right. Here we go. See, we got, we got a fresh stock here, 0%. Oh, Yoshi with some dinosaur combos. Oh, the, that was... He knew. That's a pretty common thing by Yoshi to do, but still, that was such, like, such a good presence of mind by MGG to have the banana there. <gasps> oh, that's set that... Florida oh, reset. That wow. was a reset? And he didn't get it? Oh, I don't even know the move reset like that. Like chat. Oh, okay. That move right there will break that your will shield, shield if, you, break. if you sit there. So you yeah. either need to roll or get out of it because... And it also has ridiculous priority in the air. Like, it is, the stars also hit boxes. I just run away from the move and then punish it. It's it, got it super lag. To punish. It's super lag. You just have to run away from it and then run back in. Ooh, all right. We got a relatively even game here. Like, Mr. Doom up a little bit. But Yoshi is a, t is a, is a uh, tough cookie to crumble, you know. Oh, that range was ridiculous. Speaking of magnet hands, <laughs> magnet tongue. Yeah, no kidding. Okay, all right. Go down there. That and was a nice recovery. MBG making use of the the wall jump in this game, trying to get back to the stage. Uh, Mr. Doom's got the banana. He really wants to get. Yeah, I he bet he wants a banana up smash here, but knows yeah. he can't get it. He goes for the very safe dash. MBG knew yeah. that too. That's why I kept jumping. I see. MBG was like trying super super evasive. Like, I, I, it's it's. When other characters get a hold of Diddy Kong's banana, it gets super dangerous. Like <laughs> other characters, sometimes can just like make such good use of, of it. Yoshi, the char particular characters like with up smashers, like you can just run up smash and kill super early, like Yoshi and Fox. Uh -huh. Someone who just like you can do up smash at a run, and, and the ones that actually kill, unlike Diddy Kong's, where you just randomly pop out. Oh, good forward there by MJG to space. Uh, Mr. Doom back off stage. Mr. Doom reclaims the middle confidently. Watches MJG soar over him with the monkey flip, and back to the ledge right here. Man, so it's so scary because he keeps going for the jab. You don't want to like let go of shield because he can get jab up smash off Yo as Yoshi, and, and Yoshi's jab is so good. Yeah. And oh, Mr. Doom playing super bad. You can see he's going for those MP short hops, just like coming back down the ground. Like, all right, I'll wait. Uh, Mr. Doom has the banana here. This is scary for MJG, especially because MJG really needs one more hit before a down tilt up smash is gonna kill Yoshi because Yoshi's pretty heavy even with that much rage. I really don't think that will kill right now. 
Maybe banana ended down to Yeah, it is FD. FD has some pretty big boundaries from that. But even though it's not a uh, quite battlefield, but oh, he was for jab. Maybe he's too high for. <gasps> oh, I thought the banana. I thought the the egg was there to cover the air dodge, and he was going for something like real slick off air dodge. Oh, oh just clipping him with the edge of the kick hit box. Down tilt up smash is going to kill now. With as much rage as MJG has. Okay. I don't know if any of Yoshi's kill setups will work anymore. Yeah, I think it might be a too high a percentage. Oh. oh, he. Oh, see, he he recognized that he was be running too far and like yep. bailed out of that read. He had the read. He had the Back read. There. But he knew it wasn't safe. Dead. And that'll GG. do it. GG. 3-0 and winners finals from MJG. I think we got freezer. Are you playing? Who are you playing? Who are you playing? Oh, we have place right here. What? Are you? Are you you're playing on stream, right? Uh, yeah, they told me I was actually next. All right, then. I was get gonna tell you was, uh, so. We're leaving really soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. What? I just the that's the just Lawrence Carpool. Mm, man, if, I, if if we had known beforehand, we could have planned for this, but we did not. So unfortunately, we cannot. I would love to participate, but you know, he should be. They should be coming. A 